Hello all, welcome back to this old save. Serious Lee's here, and today we're going to continue working on titles. I'm going to go check in. We got a couple of ones done between episodes, like I thought we might. Finished up those ones from last time. Oops, that's where we scrap ships. Here's where we check titles. Now, in between episodes, I've done a lot more work on the freighter one, and we still have not gotten it. So we've got pretty much everything. It's all white. It'll be grayed out if we don't have it. Uh, well, we're, uh, it doesn't matter. You'll see. We, we'll go right by the ones we were working on last time. <laughs> uh, we need to get to... It's right around here somewhere. Yes, archaeologist. We have did a little bit of that last time. Uh, I think I still have the treasures. We can check how many we dug up last time, but it's obviously not 30, so we'll have to keep going on that one. Uh, but we're not doing that today. We're going to keep going for derelicts today. However, I've done a lot of derelict work. You'll see. We'll go over that in just a sec. What else are we missing? Uh, I think those are the last two we can get. Oh no, they're Sentinel Pillars. We need to go do a whole bunch of Sentinel Pillars for Hive Lord and start a new save for Trader. Alright, so. Not much left to do on the titles front, so let's see about Derelicts. Let's see if we can get any of those done today. We're going to do some random derelicts, because I've definitely done, obviously, I have done more than 30 derelicts. I've done more than seven. Look, I've got full slots. I've got full freighter slots here. How do we expand our cargo? Is that full? Can we get more? I, should, I have more cargo ball heads. They stopped letting me in. I'm assuming I'm done. Anyway, I've done a lot of derelicts. Why don't I have that title? So... Maybe it's because I've done all the same derelicts, right? Uh, well, not all the exact same derelicts, but I haven't done 30 unique derelicts. As you can see, I have this one here from the SV Hizomato 6, and then the Yellow Nodat, and then the Invincible Iruno, and then all of these are going to be the same three ships, right? But I used to have six modules of each type, and they were all unique. So that's six unique ships. See, I think one of the hyperdrives is a different one. Yeah, the MS Uno. I know that was one of the ones we had. And the Newman. Yeah, those ones we didn't have over here. So there were six different ones we ran before. Uh, also, I think it's this one here. The Kochi... Kochiomi Hauler is the one from the Euclid address that I showcased recently. The fast... One, I've showcased this that lots of times. The very fast freighter for getting um, cargo bulkheads in the first place. That's this one here. So we've done that one a lot. That's where I got like 90% of my cargo bulkheads. Uh, this one here... I don't know where this one was from, but I think I just stumbled across another S-Class when I started doing uh, freighters. I started doing derelicts again in preparation for this. I was trying to work towards getting this done. And I just did the same system a couple of times. However, a weird glitch happened where when I left the system, it kept giving me modules from this ship, the Oma <laughs> Kitam Explorer there. Uh, no matter what system I went to, I went to four or five different systems and I kept getting S-Class modules. I thought, at first, I thought, I just found five different S-Class derelict freighters. That's really cool. But then I looked at the name, and I kept landing on the same derelict, no matter what star system I went to. And I think it's because I was cheating. <laughs> I was putting my derelict receiver into my... Where is... Oh, that's not in here. It's in my exosuit. I was putting it in here. Putting the receivers in that thing. Uh, I think that might have screwed me up. I don't know. But I had... I stopped doing that. I took them out. I put them into my stash of receivers and it happened to me again look I moved star systems and this SV Suwaj spirit uh, it kept coming up three or four different star systems I reloaded the save after the third one I'm like well, no 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 I already did this ship so I am on my very last receiver somewhere where did it go there it is right there we can hold a hundred I've got one we're gonna warp somewhere and we're going to try to get that going on. See if we can get oh, one that we haven't got before. Let's take another peek at the inventory real quick-like. Go back to the freighter. 
scroll down. So I have 10 unique names, new 11 unique names now here of different freighters that I have found, plus the six from there. That's 17 unique freighters. If we need 30, we're about halfway done. So we're gonna go and try and do that. And I don't know that it needs to be unique freighters. I'm pretty sure that this is just bugged, but I like doing derelicts and I like doing random derelicts, even if they got bugs in them. So let's go do some derelicts today. Uh, we could warp in our freighter, but we're already in the ship. Let's just warp in our ship. We might have to do a um, freighter rescue if we do that, but we'll see what happens. Uh, we're not going to do derelict here. I've already done one here and it was unique, so we're going to move on. Let's go a decent ways away and find a three-star economy. Was that one? No. Doesn't need to be a three-star economy, but that's the kind that I like to find. And you know what? Let's change the race, uh, the filter to the races, and we'll go or life forms, I guess. We'll look for Viking ones, just for the extra nanites. Nothing in particular extra we need from Vikings. Uh, actually, you know, we sort of do need Corvax for if we want to try to get that random. Oh, well, never mind. There's a three-star Viking. Two-star conflict. We'll go there. That's fine. We're not going to spend much time in space. We're going to be in a derelict. So we should be able to activate the receiver from our freighter, even though it's not in the system with us. And we should be able to unlock the door and consume the receiver. It won't, uh, won't get doubled or copied up. we got three planets, two moons. If this is a nice system, if this doesn't double up our receiver, we might want to explore this place. All right, let's activate that thing. Normally, I would go to the space station first, get that into the uh, old log there so we can come back here later by a teleport but if we're going to do a derelict that I've already done I'm going to reload the save and we'll go somewhere else that seems to be the only thing that's worked for me to get this problem fixed is warping somewhere else uh, reloading the save and warping somewhere else seems to do it I don't know what causes this thing oh uh, okay the MS OB here. I can tell you right now I don't recognize that name, but let's just double check. Here's all the ones we've got. We've got the Kuzent, the Okasio, or whatever. Nope. 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 Uh, no. Okay. Ooh, that's an interesting name. The Butcher of Inume. Okay. Gajor Holler. No, no. All right, cool. So this is a new derelict. We're going to run this one see what we got. Something that I found is because that I have installed the ricochet module on my pulse spitter just for that extra damage because it gives adjacency bonuses. Uh, it's not a great weapon for derelicts that have bugs on them if you want to avoid letting out the bugs. If you want to clear the bugs, it works. It works for that. Uh, we're going to want our flashlight on. There we go. Hmm. I see jars with bugs in them, but I don't see goop yet. Usually you got to go past the first door anyway to find goop. Oh, and uh, I've been flying around space station to space station to collect missions to kill creatures, so let's kill a bunch of them. The uh, blaze javelin works pretty well. You can break down doors that have um, goop holding them without any ricochet worries. Doesn't look like we're going to need to worry about that here. I wonder, can we kill these guys in one hit if we charge it up? Well, he's not shooting back at us, but I don't think we killed him. But these guys count, these jellyfish, as uh, fauna. So if you stockpile a bunch of call fauna missions, 
and then go do a couple of derelicts. The two or three jellyfish you come across. Why is everyone screeching at us? Come on, guys. <laughs> Oh, now you don't want to play, huh? All right, fine. We're skipping all the terminals except the last one. We just need to do the salvage in engineering. Oh, it looks like we're in a hangar bay. Cool. Got a couple modules while we're here. A class and probably C class. Yeah, I find one is usually C-Class for some reason. No jellyfish in engineering? Ah, oh, that's unusual. Usually there's two. All right, what kind of module do we get here? Let's see, I'm going to guess B-Class. I'm always picking technology just so I can remember which one I got this from, because bulkheads all are the same. Ooh, C-Class, okay. Alright, on to the next one. However, what I would like to do is stop at the space station here because we haven't done it yet and I, knew I need a new receiver. So we can stop at the space station on the next system, but, you know, why not stop here, get it on the list, grab our nanites. See if there's any other missions to call creatures. That way we can stack even more missions for the next derelict as well. All right. And what do we got in the main inventory? Here we go. We have, is it 10 a wide? 10, 13 different artifacts dug up by this character alone not including any ones that he did on the expedition he started on or otherwise. But just from us hunting stuff down on that Sporal planet the other day. Uh, all right, check the multi-tool because you should check the multi-tool. C-class, nothing to write home about. Let's turn that flashlight off. Poor Viking behind the terminal there. We blinded the guy. All right, nanites. Straight across to the other side. We don't need anything else over there. Nanites. And missions. Uh, we could hand in some. We're done a couple, apparently. Get some cake. Get a defense chit. I do not want a defense chit. Uh, I don't think they count as predators, so I'm not taking the predator ones. I took one, and it hasn't completed yet. So I have a kill predator mission on the on the log already. Not going to worry about that. Let's buy our receiver. Forgot to do that while we were over there. Silly me. Okay, yeah, mercenary skills link. Okay, that's good. That is good, actually. We can get better missions now. All right. Uh, yeah, I've already bought a whole bunch today. <laughs> I've been doing this a lot. Uh, we were at 1.7 something billion. We are now at 1.5 something billion. So we've spent 200 million units pretty much exclusively on derelict receivers over the last couple of days. And we're going to spend more. Oh, uh, while we're here, I mean, we can do it anywhere before we forget, I mean. Let's take our reward salvage fleet combat unit and we'll put it into the list. Now we have 12 done. Plus our six, we have 18 done. All right, on to the next one. We're going to go somewhere close by. I saw that. Another Viking three-star system. Uh, this is maybe what a problem I was having earlier. I stopped doing it 
I stopped going to local nearby stars and it uh, seemed to clear up the issue, but let's see what happens. We saved our module so we don't need to worry about uh, remembering the name of the freighter we were just on. Because I already don't. Interesting. Uh, we're gonna hit scan right away because that's a very nice looking planet. Verdant planet with purple grass and purple skies in an amazing blue color space. Wow. Uh, even if we get a repeat derelict here, we might visit the space station because this is just really, really pretty. Uh, Alright, here's our guy. Activate that. We'll do a pulse. Oh, I missed. There we go. I want to get the planet in view. Also, if you land on this side, you exit your ship on the right-hand side, so you start right beside the entrance. Alright, the yellow Nogatot. Now, I definitely saw that we had a yellow something, but it was not the Nogatot. We'll check while the door's opening. We can reload at any point along this derelict, and uh, we won't lose any progress. Or, well, we'll lose all the progress on the derelict, but nothing is saved here, so... Yellow something was on here. Yellow Kesson, that's the one. So yeah, this is a different ship. This is the SS Yellow. Something or other. Nogat? Nogatot. All right, flashlight back on. Right past the floating hand. Jellyfish, another shuttle bay, another two ships. There you go, call creatures, uh, alarming shadows, mission complete. Got a C class and an A class again. We can grab stuff along the way, why not? Got some tainted metal there. Avoid the purple doors. Just trying to get to the end. I've also tried doing uh, the same ship like 20 times in a row, uh, completing the whole ship with that fast ship. The fast Euclid one, that did not seem to finish the title unlock. So this is the last thing I can think of, and I wanted to find some new stuff anyway. Explore some ships I'd never been on before. See how fast we could do a bunch of them. Gotten pretty lucky so far, no bugs. I got nothing but bugs when I was doing this earlier, getting those 10 modules unlocked. We're just gonna run right past these annoying, noisy guys. They didn't even see us this time. All right, uh, yeah, there's a stairway over there. That's probably the way to go. Oh, there's a stairway over here too. Or a doorway at least. What's in the door? Purple? We'll go on the stairs. Uh, a trick for freighters, if you get lost in a freighter and you don't know if you're coming or going towards a stair that you should go up or down, if you see the yellow wires, that's the way to go. If the stairs are facing the wrong way and you have to walk around to the backside to climb up, that's the way you came from. Uh, similarly, if you're going down, you should be able to see the wires when you're pointed at the staircase, the way that you entered the room from. That's the way you're going. All right, another call creatures mission done. Another freighter done. Construct technology upgrade. Hey, we got an A-class, cool. Nope, don't want to talk to that. I want to talk to the teleporter, please. Thank you. Boop. 
I like to just tap myself in because these things are finicky and you end up teleporting back and forth. So if you just walk in slightly, get your bearings, you can figure out which way to leave the teleporter at the other end. Alright, so we definitely want to capture this space station, and it appears to be straight ahead of me. I sort of want to go explore that planet right away, but we'll, we'll hold off. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. It was the Viking uh, plaques visiting and the boundary failures. I had to visit a lot of boundary failures to get that one to pop, and I never got the mission to show, or sorry, the title to show up as a reward. Uh, I just finally got to the end of the boundary failure lore and had it repeat. The last message just repeats endlessly. Yeah, you know what? We'll we'll go hand in. May as well while we're here. We haven't talked to this agent yet, have we? So we got oh, we're blinding him too. Uh, hand in mission. Oh, we completed a bunch. Hey, look there, another purple one. A bunch of nanites. Excellent. We also got a bunch of explorers guild rep for that. Uh, explorers very rarely want you to call creatures, so that was a nice find. Nanites, flashlight, there we go. That's the downside of going to the space station between every derelict is forgetting to turn your flashlight back on and off. I mean, we don't have to. We can just blind these NPCs. They don't really care, do they? That would be a very interesting game mechanic is if uh, merchants gave you worse prices if you had your flashlight on. All right, nothing special. It's a bit neat. A-class. I like this little underhang thing there. I don't know what that is. Bandolier clip, maybe? All right, we are done here, but we're gonna need another receiver for 30 million. We're, we're definitely not looting enough of these that it's worth it, but it's okay, it's okay. We'll make more. Uh, stasis devices, no problem. Off to the next system. I think we got time for another derelict. Wow, very pretty stuff here. We can scan some other planets, but I will be back to this one. What's the name of this system while we're here? So I remember. Inspiro. Yes, I'm very Inspiroed. Let's head away from Inspiro. Let's go oh, anywhere. Let's also go to Viking. Oh, you know what? Let's go to Corvax, to Lot Jara, three-star system, right next door. Doesn't look like there's very many planets, but that's okay. We're looking for derelict craters, not planets. <laughs> Unless we find another gorgeous purple lush planet like that. Actually, that would be great because we do want a Corvax slush planet to wander around on on foot so we can get... Oh, hey, look at that. Uh, we can get that rare title to pop up. Scan you. Paradise planet. Whoa, what a coincidental find. Not too keen on the space color here, but it's a nice consistent green. Ah, no, there's some... Well, you know what? The lime is almost better than the mossy color everywhere else. Anyway, let's head towards the moss. Uh, let's head towards that storm. Oop, straight through a storm. Okay, so we were just on the yellow nougat or something like that. No good, tut, or whatever it was, doesn't matter. The yellow something. Let's see what this guy is. You can tell as soon as you hop out of your ship, it should say in the bottom left corner the name of the freighter you're on. Yeah, see, look, the SS Yellow Nogatot. Okay, so we haven't made a save here. So, what we're gonna do is we've made an autosave here. So we're gonna reload the restore point. We're gonna go somewhere else.
we don't want the Nogatot. We just did the Nogatot. You saw, like, that's the bug that I've been having happening. I guess it has nothing to do with having bugged out my receivers in my um, refiner. Yeah. Thought it might just be the price you pay for cheating, but it's not, apparently. It's just buggy. There's something weird going on with Derelicts. Something funky. So, we should be in that Viking system still. Yes, we are. All right. Now, unfortunately, we lost that uh, Corvac system. No big deal. Uh, it's easy enough to find. It's right next door. Oh, uh, let's check on stuff, actually. Uh, exosuit. Uh, did I buy another receiver yet? I don't think I did. Uh, this is from when we got out of the ship. All right, well, we got to buy a receiver from wherever we go then. Or go back to the station. All right, well, we don't have time to do another derelict, but let's see if we can find one. Yeah, return to Mission Asian. I haven't handed in my missions, nothing like that. Okay, well, I'm not going to hand in the missions. I'm just going to buy another receiver and then warp anywhere else, basically. I would like there to be a space station there, though, so I can buy another receiver when we're done. And it may as well be a three-star economy. Where, where am I going? Receivers are over here, not at the merchant in the back room. This time, we'll make a save in case the same thing happens. We'll have the receiver already in our inventory. There we go. All right, so there was a Corvax. I think it was a green star. Oh, no, there it is right there. Lot Jara, it's a yellow star right nearby if we want to find that place for later. Let's go, I don't know, over here. Um, there we go, a GEC system, three-star economy, that'll do. Ah, we'll go a little bit over time, we'll finish whatever derelicts here. Unless it's the Nogatot. Just say no to Nogatot. Yeah, I guess it has nothing to do with the receivers themselves. It seems like derelicts are bugged because that's a pretty important feature of how they're supposed to work, is that they're unique for every star system. Okay, so let's quickly activate our new receiver. No fancy planets to be distracted by here. I mean, there's some nice planets, but I'm not distracted for the space color here, though. All right, what do we got? Okay, yeah, MV Kiwa, Ikawa. That sounds like a real place. Uh, recharge that, that, that's what we need. All right, let's see what this guy's got. We're going way over time. We got a minute left. We cannot finish a derelict in a minute. Door first, heater after, if you're in a hurry. Gotta get those repair kits. Especially these days, now that any old asteroid hits your ship shields can damage the something. Flashlight. No goop in the first room. It's a good sign. Ah, you're not important. Let's get going. Oh, where are we going? 
purple. There's blue. Missed. <laughs> and the trick for going down ladders, hold off to the side. But as you saw, we were headed down that ladder and we saw the yellow on it. If the ladder was on the other side, the side that we were on, that would be where we came from. Ah, oh, weapon charge depleted. I guess we're not killing any more jellyfish today. That's okay, we're in a hurry. See, yellow wires. Definitely better weapons, and we could switch to the pulse bitter now that we can see that there aren't any. Um... Guys, to worry about bursting into a bunch of guys. Uh, those actually work too. Those will work for hunting creatures as well if you need a call creature mission. I just prefer these guys. It takes a little bit more time, but they're a lot less of a hassle. one. All right, another ship done. So that's the process. I'm going through this. Let's see if we get our title. I very much doubt it. Oh, you know what we can do? We can go to the space station here. Since we're overtime anyway. B class, there we go. And let's go check. Let's see if the title unlocked like that other one did without giving me a heads up. Maybe we maybe we unlocked it today. We saw at the beginning of the episode, I did not have it unlocked, so let's go take a peek at the end of the episode. Alright, where is... There we go. No, no. There we go. Unfortunately, I don't have any specific need for a Gek star system here, but... Something I have not tested is whether or not I could head back to the place we just were and go to that Corvax system that we found, and if that would now show as this this freighter that we just did, or if it would be the yellow Nogatod again. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, flashlight receiver for the next one. Okay, and while we're here, I also can't remember why we came to the space station. Sorry. <laughs> See, class. All right. Uh, yeah, no, I can't remember at all. But we made our save here. That's about it. Uh, I'm going to keep doing this. Oh, uh, yeah, title, title. That's why we're here. It was this side. I knew I needed to go up this side. Alright, let's see. Nice holler. Just down past the end here. Salvager still locked. Alright, we don't have it yet. That's unfortunate. Maybe next time. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but until next time, <laughs> have a good time.